Hello and welcome. This is Pokemon Vet coming at you with another uh, Pokemon trading card game unboxing video. Uh, today we have the brand new uh, Sun and Moon Cosmic Eclipse set. The set came out on November 1st. This is the last Sun and Moon set. It, it will be the next set will be coming out in February and it will be entitled Sword and Shield. It will have 8th gen Pokemon in it. Uh, to pair with the release of the games for the Nintendo Switch on November 15th, Pokemon Sword and Shield. Uh, we got a couple of the loose booster packs here, and then we also have an Elite Trainer box. I think we're going to start with the Elite Trainer box here, so I can get the sleeves out from it. Per our new rules, I will be giving away all the code cards if we pull an Ultra Rare or Secret Rare in the pack. Now this set's really cool because it introduced something new. Uh, character cards. Uh, all of the cards in this set, well most of the tag team cards, have characters included with them, as well as there being Secret Rare cards um, that highlight certain Pokemon trainers and some of their uh, signature Pokemon from the games and anime. All right. Here's the book right here. Player's Guide, it's called. The best thing about this is if you're into the TCG, it tells you about some of the new trainer cards. It tells you about some of the new um, GX cards, the tag team cards, and what you can do with them. And some of the also brand new in the set, the tag team trainer cards. I'm hoping to pull a couple of those. It also has the card set list. This is the biggest set ever released in Pokemon. Um, if we scroll through here real quick, there is another Charizard in here. A Charizard and Braxton GX. As well as a Venusaur and Snivy, a Blastoise and Piplup, um, Reshiram and Zekrom, Solgaleo and Lunala GX, uh, Oracorio GX, nothing crazy there, Flygon GX. Not a Dragon type though. Um, there is a Togepi, Cleffa, and um, Igglybuff Tag Team GX, the, the Baby Trio. And then there's the God Trio as well with Arceus, Palkia, and Dialga. Hoping to pull one of those cards. We also have the Reshiram and Zekrom GX, the Nagadell and Guzzlord GX, the Megalopony and Jumpuff GX. Um, then we have some of the Tag Team Trainer cards. You can see they're labeled tag team at the top. Here we get into some of the good cards here. The alternate arts for them. Um, alternate art for the, the god tree is very cool. It's like a mural. Or not a mural. It's more of a uh, a shrine, a statue. We have some of the full art trainer tag team cards. Uh, the red and blue is very cool, I think. Then we have the character cards down here. As you can see, uh, there's red with Pikachu. Uh, probably the one I'm looking for the most. Uh, they did the Rainbow Rares a little bit different. If you can see the color difference, here's what the older ones would look like. Here's the newer ones. It's almost, um, uh, what is that called when you reverse the color scheme? Uh, that's what it is anyway. Uh, so they have some cool ones there. And then again, some gold trainer cards with the last card being the set number 271 so enough with that let's get into some pokemon opening here <clears throat> not trying to waste too much of your time or bore you all right let's get this all out of the way here set that to the side we have sleeves with the God Trio on there, Dialga, Arceus, and Palkia. Very nice. Probably going to use these today if we get any good pulls. Opening uh, 15 packs, I believe, so hopefully. Set that to the side here. We have your standard massive energy cards. Throw that in the hat over here, as you might know we have. GX token, damage markers. 
here we have the dice for it. Really interesting uh, dark blue, light blue with the pink combination on there. And then kind of a dark green and almost cloudy for the large die. Very nice. We also have some separators right here. Deck separators. Let's see if I can get the code card out. You can go ahead and have this code card right here. It's for the Elite Trainer Box. I believe it'll give you the sleeves. And we have one, two, three, four, and four packs from here as well. So, without further ado, let's move all this out of the way here and get into the newest set, Sun and Moon Cosmic Eclipse. First pack, we have a Solgaleo and Lunala, which is a tag team for this set. This would be a really cool set to complete, considering it is the last Sword and Shield set. Um, so, one, two, three, four for that. Steel Energy to start us out today, or Metal, into the hat. We have Will, Mim Mimikyu, Beastite, Nosepass, Litleo, Flababy, Sveal, Metu, Reverse is a Trap Wrench, Common, and Kyogre for the Rare. I believe the two uh, theme decks for this are Cryogre and Groudon, which is very exciting for me, considering I'm a Gen 3 enthusiast, if you can call me that. Let's get to our next pack here. One, two, three, four cards. Fairy Energy. Into the hat. We have a Gold Duck, a Will, Mimikyu, Rowlet, Lillipup, a Skrelp, there's a Pikachu, I actually like the artwork on that Pikachu a lot, he looks like he's ready to fight, a Stuffle, there we have it, there's a character card right there, uh, this is a Secret Rare, number 238 out of 236, uh, here's the code card for that one for you. Um, just to clarify, uh, this does look like it was a green code card as well, so, and it did take the reverse rare spot. Uh, very nice on that, though. Uh, I have heard a little talk about people complaining about the yellow borders on the cards, wishing it was a, more of a, um, it encompassed the whole card, but I, I don't really mind it. I still think it's a, a fantastic card there. And a Napoleon for a rare. I think I'm going to throw this guy here in his sleeve. Now, I believe the first round of Sword and Shield cards are actually coming out as promo cards. I believe they're being released on the 15th in boxes. Specific boxes. I believe they have a box for each of the starters. I believe they have Cosmic Eclipse in there as well. One, two, three, four. Water Energy. Into the hat. A Clefairy. Abapong. Gold Duck. Jangmo. Rowlet. Scrope. Pikachu. There's a Teddy Urser, that's new. We have a Beware, which is a reverse rare. Very nice. And Sunflower for the rare. Here we got a Blast Toys and Piplup pack. Again, one of the tag teams featured in this set. It's, I think it's really nice that with this set they incorporated having the the original first three starters come back and be in a tag team. Although I'm a little questioning about the fact that um, this is Charizard's second tag team card. I'm not complaining, just questioning. CeeLo, Draw Energy, 
Cosmo, Routes, Passimian, Jangmamo, Rowlet, Scrope. There's an Eevee, Reverse Common, and a Mimikyu for the rare. Hmm. I feel like we already pulled Mimikyu here. Let me just look around real quick for a second. Because if we did, that means we had an error box. Unless there's a Mimikyu that's not a rare. Yep, there's a Mimikyu right there. And it's just an uncommon. So that's very interesting, having two Mimikyu's in it with different card rarities. Alright, next pack. Another Soul Vallejo and Lunala. And uh, their tag team card uh, actually has Lily featured in it as well. So that's kind of cool. One, two, three, four. Leaf Energy into the hat. We have a Rapidash by Brava, Probopass, Avapon, Onyx, Tepig, Alone Sandshrew, Snorut, a Stuffle for the reverse, and a Zatu for the rare. So far, it seems like we had one pull, and there are five packs in. Not too bad. Um, hopefully, the pull rates aren't like. Uh, unbroken bonds level where you just it feels like you know open up an entire booster box and not get anything but hopefully that's not like that one two three four water energy there we have it there's a tag team trainer card Malu and Lana very nice Pangoru rapid dash there's a rock rough Deerling, Teddy Ursa, Golet, Dewpider. Reverse is a reverse rare Florgas. Very nice. That's our second reverse rare. And a Walrent. Alright. Another Blastoise and Pip Fluff right here. I am just looking at these packs today. One, two, three, four. Psychic Energy into the hat. The Leap has a Jilteon. Only an uncommon right there. Pangoru. Palpitoad. Jangmo. There's a different artwork. Deerling. Golet. Dewpider. We have a Heliolisk. Which is, an, again, another reverse rare. We've been getting really lucky with that tonight. And a Wishy Washy GX. So this is our first GX pool of the night. Um, very interesting. I didn't even realize they had a Wishy Washy GX. I must have missed that when I was looking at the set list. Um, not the most incredible Pokemon, but... And I don't think it's going to be very playable, considering the GX move... Just has you put basic Pokemon on your deck. Or on your bench. So. But we'll sleeve him up nonetheless. Throw him up there. And again, as promised. Here's the code card for that one. Alright, last pack of that Elite Trainer box. Let's hope we got at least one more pull out of here. One, two, three, four. Fighting energy. Into the hat. A beastite. The leap. Jolteon. Ponard. Lit Leo. Coughing. Nose pass. Snorunt. Uh, another uh, reverse trap inch. This one of different art. And a holographic uh, lichen rock for the rare. Very nice. According to its ability, if the other Pokemon is a GX or EX, it can attack. 
without using any energy. So that's very cool. Alright, time to get some down to some of our individual packs here. Let's see what we can do here. We have a single booster pack. And I believe I have seven of those. So, about halfway through for the night. Out of that one came a Lunala and Sokaleo. Metal Energy, Lana's Fishing Rod, Vaporeon, Absol, Sveal, Natu, a Palpitoad, Jangmo, Deerling, Reverse is a Heracross, an Uncommon, and Browdon for the rare. That matches nice with a Kryogre. Alright, let's get into our next one. Looks like we have a Blast Toys and Piplup. Let's see what's inside of it though. Uh, baby Pokemon. Man, I'm just ripping these packs apart tonight, guys. One, two, three, four. Water energy. We have another Mallow and Lana tag team card. A Beastite. Tag call. Haven't seen that one yet. Stuffle. Pawnard. Lit Leo. Coughing. Nose pass. Reverse is a Lunala. Okay. I believe that's a reverse, and I think the normal one's a holographic then as well, so that's another reverse rare tonight. And an Armaldo for the rare. Okay. I have another Blastoise and Piplup here. Yep, Blastoise and Piplup inside as well. Maybe that bodes some good luck for us. One, two, three, four. Psychic Energy. Lily. Rotom. Erica. Golet. Dewfighter. Apom. Onyx. Tepig. Reverse is a Teddy Ursa. And Mark Cargo for the rare. Alright, four packs left. Start off with a tag team babies here. Which had a the God Trio inside. One, two, three, four. Fighting energy. Lily's Full Force. Haven't seen that card yet tonight. Or this one, Clay. A Primplup. Passimian. Rowlet. Lilypup. Scrub. Pikachu. Reverses a Palpitoad. And a Lantern for the rare. So at least we haven't, we haven't gotten any um, rare copies yet. So that's very nice. We have a Blastoise and Piplup too. With a uh, Sogaleo Lunala pack art. One, two, three, four. Leaf Energy. Into the hat. A Jolteon. There's an Ends Resolve. Another card we haven't seen yet. Mawile, 
Low and Sandshrew, Snorrent, Coughing, Drillbur, Swirlix, a Clefairy for the Uncommon, Uncommon Reverse, and a Golurk for the Rare. Alright. Two packs left. We have a Sogaleo Lunala right here. They had a Baby Trio GX inside. One, two, three, four. Fairy Energy into the hat. Type of Knoll. Haven't seen that one. Heracross. Awaknid. Cottony. Rowlet. Phantump. There's an Alolan Grimer. Magnemite. And a Prim Prump. Piplup. Sorry about that. Not Prim Prump. A Piplup character card with Dawn right there. Very nice. Go ahead and sleeve that up. And then I'll uh, oop, probably show you the rare is an Ursa Ring. Again, I really like these character cards. Um, I think the artwork's beautiful on them. Uh, it almost, it's like a, it's almost got, it's different. The hollow is different than what it is on the GX cards. Um, but it's very nice, like I said. Put her up there. Again, here's that code card I just pulled out with. Right here. Again, that was a green card. So, kind of makes it interesting. And then the last pack we have Cosmic Eclipse with the Legendary Trio on it. Or the Gods Trio. Creation Trio, as well as it's called. With a Creation Trio pack inside of it. So let's hope we can get some last pack magic here. This pack really doesn't want to open. Alright, there we go. One, two, three, four. Fire energy. This is a new card you haven't seen yet. Dragmonium Z. Dragon Claw. Very interesting. Arachnid. Draw Energy. Golet. Dewbiter. Avapalm. Onyx. Tepig. Reverse is a Lillipup. And Golurk for a rare. Or only double rare tonight. Alright. So, out of 15 packs, I don't know if the luck was with us tonight or. What was going on? We had one holographic pull with holographic Lycan Rock. We had two secret rare pulls with character cards. We had the Weavile and the Piplup. And then we had one GX pull with Wishy Washy GX. So uh, decide for yourself, really. Um, are the, is the pull rates in Cosmic Eclipse going to be ridiculous again? Considering the set has 271 cards, or is it going to give us a little bit more leeway? I'll be opening up more of Cosmic Eclipse really soon. Um, stay tuned, thanks for watching, and remember, have a great rest of your day. This is Pokemon Vet, signing off.